Good afternoon. How's everybody today? Hope you're doing well. It's er no, it's not early. It's uh, lunchtime, and I gotta run off for my dental appointment. My dentist is back, and she's gonna look at the problem tooth. I guess I can't put it off if I'm gonna be on time, right? I gotta go. Okay, home now. I went to the dentist, and um, I haven't seen her for about three years, but she's really, really nice lady. She's like a, I feel like she's my sister, the sister I never had. She, I walked in, I said, um, Swadika, she goes, she goes, Swadika, I said, how are you? She goes, I'm fine, thank you, how are you? Long time no see, and she's, because she speaks really good English, and, um, and she seems, I know she'll probably watch this, but she seems like she's getting younger and younger every time I see her, so I need to know what your uh, magic formula is. <laughs> and she's got a, a little baby now, two years old. So that keeps her busy, or two or three, I forgot what she said now. But um, unfortunately, I had to explain to her what happened when I was there before. A Little bit negative, so I apologize. But, um, you know, I feel if somebody's taking advantage of me, I'm going to complain. But I don't like it, but I'm going to. So I, uh, I explained to her what happened, and she said, no problem, we'll have a look. So I went in, and she had a look around, and she said that that tooth, that the reason I went back is for a tooth up in here. And uh, it's got like a cavity next to a crown. So... Um, I gotta go see a consultant specialist guy on the 14th. But she found another little filling down here and did that. She says, do you want, she knows me, she says, do you want painkiller or not? I said, what do you think? She says, up to you. I said, do it. So no painkiller. She drilled the tooth, put the filling in. She says, any pain? I said, nothing. She says, no, no, no pain at all. I said, no pain. She's got water running on it, you know, cold water drilling and, and, um, but no, I didn't have any pain medicine. I just laid there and, um, cleaned it all out, put the porcelain in, UV light to harden it. And, um, went out and sat at the desk for a minute talking with her. She said, still no pain? I said, I don't feel nothing, nothing. So she said, okay, no problem. So I made an appointment to see the consultant and um on the 14th and uh he's gonna have a look at it so i might need a if i need a root canal and a crown she said it could cost twenty thousand baht. i said how much to pull it she goes no 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 <laughs> i said twenty thousand baht oh my god so i want to say to her thank you so much oh she did she checked my teeth and they did need finishing cleaning she spent about 15, 20 minutes cleaning it around and scratching and pulling and polishing. So, and didn't charge me for it. I got, she charged me 600 baht for a filling. So, but no, nothing to tidy up that other guy's mess. So, thank you. The, uh, so then I went up and had some lunch. Seems like I'm always out, huh? Come to get some lunch. This is a uh, Muslim food. It's got uh, chicken, rice, and veggies. And they give you a little bit of soup, and I got some tea. Diet one, I got. Diet cake. <laughs> Tomorrow's Friday, and I don't have to go anywhere Friday or Saturday. So tomorrow, I'm going to get my, uh, wash the front of my truck, or w just wipe it down so I don't get it wet, and then uh, start buffing the front, get it all shined up in the front. I don't have any scratches on mine. Just, there's a, like a little nick on the front over the wheel arch, like a tiny dot. So I can fix that after I buff it to see how bad it is. 
But, um, so that's my plan tomorrow. Nowhere to go. Stay home and play with my new buffer. <laughs> Make my car shiny. Sawadikab. Sabaydi. Pai Talad. Ban. Hi, Bon. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> bye. He drove down here. Two, three minutes later, he comes back and he's carrying a little boy with his arm and he fell asleep. He just come back with his little kid. And he only went down the road two minutes ago, come back and he fell asleep. Guys, guys, guys. I say things on here sometimes and not realizing what I say. And you, I get comments where you guys say to me, hey, that was really impactful, you know, it's, I, it touched a nerve or many different things. So first of all, sometimes I don't know why, why I say the things I do, but if it touches you, I'm really pleased. But I got a message today, not in, not in comments, but somewhere else, of uh, somebody who watches, no names, and uh, said, uh, their father, who's 80-some, got, got really ill, and dog passed away, who they'd been together for 11 years. So I wanna say, I'm very sorry that your uh, dad got sick, and I'm very sorry that your dog passed after 11 years. I know it's uh, painful to lose a, a dog because you, we get so attached to him. Many people say, when you go to the other side, you'll see them. You know, they're a spirit, so you'll see them. Can I say that 100% categorically? Yes, I can't prove nothing. But I believe wherever we go, they'll be there. That's what I believe. You know, because they, although they can't talk to us, they show the love, the same love we have. We, we love them and they love us straight back. They can't talk, but I know Sugar, when I, when I play with her sometimes, like, she, she'll come find me and won't leave me alone. I'm trying to work and she just keeps pushing her nose on the back of my leg like, you will stop and fuss with me. And I'll, I'll go sit at the table and I'll start petting her and she'll lay down and she just goes, she's like, her li lips curl up. I mean, and she lays there smiling. 100% sure she lays there smiling. You know, normally a dog's the lips touch each other, but not her, she's grinning. So I am sorry for her pain. And like you said, sometimes we grow in pain. If that's the case, then I must have reached black belt 15 Dan for pain, but I'm still here and still smiling. Okay guys, chapter box is finished. I'm going to close off and go in the house, have a cup of tea, chill out a little bit. Maybe even have a nap before I start editing tonight. What do you think? Look after yourselves, buckets, blessings, rivers, a peace, joy, and kindness. All the very best, guys.